everybody, welcome back to Enchanted by You. My name is Cassandra, and if you're new here, I am so happy to have you here. Um, before we jump into talking to Freddie Mercury, though, today, uh, I want to talk about some new and exciting things that are going on for November. So, one of the first things, which is actually kind of an October thing, but I do have the merch shop open up, so you can see you can get a whole bunch of cool hoodies, stickers, coffee mugs, um, t-shirts, there's two different designs and a lot of cool stuff in it. So go check that out. That is at www.teespring.com slash enchanted by you and you will see all kinds of things there. I do want to let you know if you go there and the shop looks like it's down, it's not. It runs every three days and then closes for a day and the reason is is I didn't want to run a long campaign because Teespring doesn't mail your stuff out until the campaign is over and I don't want y'all waiting like a month because when I order something online I want it right after I ordered it I don't want to wait a month a month and a half so that's how my shop runs so if you check it out it's not there go back check in 24 hours and it will be up and running for y'all some cool November things that are coming up the first one I did a lot of creepy stuff in October and so I am I guess you could say getting tired of staging my house um, a couple times a week and I've had some creepy things come over and creepy things hang out and visit me so I am kind of done with that for a little bit I'm still gonna do some creepy things though of course you guys know me we're going to do a couple of cool things um, I'm gonna start a special thing where you guys can talk to your family and I will give you all the details in a video to come within the next week so make sure to check out that and then we're also going to be doing some conspiracy theory stuff this month too I don't know if you all have ever heard of the 27 Club but it basically talks about the musicians, all the musicians, there's over 60 of them that have died at the age of 27 in mysterious deaths. Also, I'm going to be throwing in a couple cool murder mysteries this month too, so we can talk to them, see if we can figure out, you know, what happened, how they died. I've had some recommendations from you guys and you guys have been awesome. So if there are any murder mysteries that you guys are interested in or whatever I would love to hear about it leave it in the comments below or make sure to send me some of the details um, if it's not a very well-known publicized murder mystery and you can email me at enchantedbyutv at gmail.com um, as far as today though let's go ahead and talk to Freddie Mercury keeping along with the start of musicians for November and I don't know if you're familiar with Freddie Mercury but if you're not you should be he was the lead singer for Queen he also wrote pretty much all their songs um, amazing man And he died when he was 45 years old of AIDS and he died in 1991. And there is a new movie coming out about his life that is going to be hitting theaters. So I thought that I would try and talk to him and see what he thought about the movie. Do spirits get to go perform and do things like that that they enjoy doing? So we're going to talk to him and see if he can give us some answers. Now if you're new here, let me tell you about a couple ways that I do things. I actually use this spirit box that you will see is the main one. It is the PSB7 spirit box. You can see right there. Do not edit my spirit box sessions. So they do get very loud. You will hear all the noise. I apologize about all the noise. But I have found personally that the spirits that talk to me, some are not as strong as the others. And so their voices are kind of hidden in some of the waves. Now if you're listening with headphones, you can definitely clearly hear those voices. But if you're not, you might miss those voices, or if you edit out that noise, you're going to miss those voices. And I found that those voices often have a lot of important things to say. Some just aren't experienced of talking through spirit boxes. So my EVP sessions are 100% real, 100% raw. I don't edit anything out. The only editing that I do to my spirit box sessions is, one, if my camera dies, which you just did in a session that I just did, um, then you'll see a cut there, at which point you'll also see me apologizing, or two, well, I do edit when I put down what I hear in the bottom of the screen. So I don't do any cuts though on my spirit boxes. I don't do that at all so you won't see that here. So let's go ahead and talk to Freddie Mercury. Um, I'm curious what he has to say. Does he get to perform in the afterlife? Um, I don't know. Let's go ahead and see. Okay. Okay guys, are you there? I only want to talk 
talking to my guides right now. Ethan and E, are you there? Can you please help us talk to Freddie Mercury? I gotta turn this down. have to yell over it. That's crazy. Okay. Ethan and E, my guys, are you there? Please, can you come talk? Can you come through and talk for me? I'm trying to get to talk to Freddie Mercury. He was the lead singer in the band Queen. That's what he called himself. Yep. His last name was Bolsara. I hope I didn't pronounce that wrong. Freddie, when you're here, can you please say your name for me? Wow. Freddie, what was the name of the very first band that you formed when you were 12 years old? Can you tell me what the name of that band was? Do you remember what the name of that band was? You were 12 years old. Ethan, can you teach him how to talk? Freddie, what was the name of the very first band that you formed when you were 12 years old? half of your estate to your first wife. Well, I guess she was your partner. You called her your wife. Um, and your only true friend, Mary Austin. Do you have any messages for Mary? We have the same strong male voice coming through. <laughs> Freddie, do you still get to perform where you're at now in the afterlife? Do you still get to perform and write songs? You used to love to perform and everyone loved your performances. That was creepy. Are you still writing songs? What was your favorite song that you had as a hit here? What was your favorite hit song that you wrote while you were alive here with us? Can you tell us the name of that song? about you. What do you think of the movie? The new movie that they're they're coming out with about you and your life. Have you had a chance to see that movie? And what do you think about that movie? Did you get a chance to watch them make that movie and see that movie? Oh. 
What was it like to be at your live aid concert performing on stage? Can you tell me what it was like to be at your live aid concert performing on stage in front of all those people? It said it's one of the most iconic performances ever. What did you think of it? Okay, I'm going to let you go on this spirit box and I will talk to you on another one, okay? Okay guys, so the next spirit box that I want to do and that I always do in my videos is actually an app and it is the only app that I've ever found so far that works. I'm always looking for new ones. Um, this is called, you can see it right here, unfortunately it's only an iOS app. Um, I have not found a legitimate Android app so I am always looking. If you know of a legitimate Android app, please leave it in the comments below because lots of us would like to know of an Android app. Um, this one, however, is called SBX12. I use the light version, so it's free. I'm not affiliated with this company in any way. I just really like this app. Um, I get a lot of really good responses to this app, and so I use it pretty much in all my videos, you'll see this app. So we're gonna go ahead, um, I'll get that app started. This one's noisy too. If you plan on using this app, like I said, I really like this app. One of the tips though uh, for this app is don't just try, and I, I think this is pretty much with all spirit boxes, just my personal preference. I don't think it's good to guess, like listen to it and at the time guess what you think it's saying because I have found um, with a lot of paranormal investigators and myself included uh, that what you're hearing and what you think you're hearing at the time is probably going to be wrong. Now, it's not that it's bad. It's not that you're trying to, you know, make something out to what's, what it's, you know, what you want it to be or anything like that. It's more that a lot of things are going on when you're talking to the spirits. They're using your energy, they're affecting your body, they're affecting your surroundings. Now there's, there's times that everything comes through crystal clear, but there's a lot of times that it's better just to record it and instead of making those guesses and then come back, review it, and be 100% sure about what you heard. Um, another thing with this app, and actually my guides have told me to do this, and so this is why I do it at the speed that I do it. Okay, this app right here, as well as with the PS B7 Spirit Box, if you can see right here in the corner, I set my speed to 150. Um, why do I do it that way? Because I've actually had the spirits tell me to do it that way, so that's why I do it that way. Um, if I've go any slower than that, I find that it's radio junk. Um, if I go any faster than that, I have them yell at me and tell me to slow it down. So, so we're gonna go ahead, use this app, see if we can talk some more to Freddie Mercury, and listen close, but be careful because this one's loud and noisy too. Guys, are you there? Ethan and E, are you there and can talk with me? You're talking? Do you still have Freddie Mercury with you, please? Freddie, there is someone that you said was your only true friend. And you left this woman half of your estate and your home. What is her name? Do you still stay there and watch over her all the time? Freddie, we're really curious. Do you still get to perform where you're at? Freddie, do you still write songs? How are you doing since you've passed?
Do you have any messages for your fans that love you so much still? Do you have anything else you would like to say? Okay, I need to let you go. Goodbye. Wow, guys, that was amazing. I think we heard a lot of really cool stuff. Um, I will go back through and review it, and anything that I hear will be listed throughout the video. Um, anything that you hear that I miss, please put it in the comments below. And let me know of 27 uh, club members that you would like me to talk to next. Uh, put those in the comments below, too. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you can be notified as soon as... All the cool new mystery videos and conspiracy videos and family videos even come out this month and I will talk to you later guys. Love y'all. Bye.